Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Carissa and I do different videos ranging from motherhood, home decor, lifestyle. So if you like all those kinds of videos, then definitely consider hitting that subscribe button down below. And for those of you that are subscribed to my channel, I'm going to ask for your help. YouTube once again changed things around and they're no longer having the subscription feed in chronological order. So some of you have been telling me you've been missing out on a lot of my videos. The easiest way to never miss one is to hit that notification bell, not once, but twice now, because if you hit it once, they're going to notify you occasionally. If you hit it twice, it will let you know every time I post a new video. For the month of June, if you guys don't know, I will definitely, 100%, I have plans three videos a week, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. So you can always check back here on those days to see what the latest video is. For today, we're doing a toddler haul. This one is going to be summer clothing related. You guys have seen the one I did for the fall, for the spring, and you seem to really enjoy it. So since Mila's birthday was about, I want to say, like two weeks ago, we got a couple of clothing items for her birthday, and then I, of course, have been picking up a couple of things here and there. So I figured when I would dive right in and show you all the things we have for summer 2018. Here I put everything inside this big bag right here. This way it's easier when showing you. It's from a variety of stores, so although it's just in the Jamie and Jack bag, I do have different things from like Old Navy, Carter's, Target, a variety of different items. The first thing, let's just dive into basically what's at the top going down to the bottom because that's probably what's easiest. So the first thing is these white pair of little shorts. It's just a stretchy type of material, which I love because that means it's going to be really comfortable for me to wear. And they have this detailing of yellow on it. So I want to say it's like little arrows going in different directions. It's a really pretty print and it is embroidered onto the shorts. And then to go with that, we have this really pretty yellow blouse. I love putting in Mila in yellow. It just looks really nice with her skin tone. So this yellow top, it's nice and like loose and flowy. This way she'll be comfortable while still looking cute. You guys know that's what I'm all about, especially now that she's a toddler. We're all about the comfort as well as looking adorable. And then the sleeve, same thing. It's a nice like soft flutter sleeve and it's extremely lightweight. So in the summertime, she won't be like sweating and uncomfortable in these clothing. So that was the first outfit. The next outfit, same thing, it's like a two-piece separate and it came with these little like denim style shorts but rather than being like a traditional denim, it has this elastic band at the top so it's going to be once again really comfortable. It's not a true jean material, it's more I want to say like a lightweight denim style but more like linen. And then right at the front it has this little bow detailing in like a blush pink with little florals on it to match the pattern of the blouse that it goes with. So once again, another little flowy blouse that she can wear. It's like that blush coral type of shade. So perfect for summertime. And then the floral details on it, if you guys can see, are like a um, navy type of color to pair perfectly with the shorts. A nice easy outfit that we can dress up or dress down depending what we have planned for the day. Then if you guys checked out my spring toddler haul, I showed you a lot of the dresses that I picked up for her. So I went a little bit larger on the sizes. This way she could wear them for all of spring. And now that we're going into summer, she can wear them all of summer as well. So I did get one more that I just wanted to show you guys. So along with the other dresses that she has, they're very easy to put on and pair with any outfit. So I do like to get her flowy dresses. I saw this one at Marshall's. I thought it was so adorable. Also, those two outfits, those were also from Marshalls or TJ Maxx, one of those two. And then this one is flowy, it's white, so I think it looks really pretty. Same thing when we're like at the beach or something like that, and I just want to throw it over to go on the boardwalk for like a night out. That's really simple and easy. It has this really pretty tassel detail at the top of like multi-colors, and then the bottom, as I told you, all of this is like an embroidered detail and it's just multicolored. I just feel like if they had this in my size, I definitely would pick it up because it's just really cute and a super simple outfit to pair with a pair of sandals. And this one, I believe, um, was only like $12.99. Onto a pair of shorts. I love the Cat and Jack line from Target. If you guys, same thing, have seen previous hauls, you know I always rave about them. And they're super affordable. These little shorts, I believe, let's see, these were only $5 and they have a variety of colors. I can't find the other pair that I picked up, but it was the same type of denim. It's a very stretchy, so it's almost like the jeggings that they sell. So it's going to fit her body really well and she'll feel almost like she's wearing a pair of leggings, but of course shorts, so she's not like so hot in them for the summertime. And I picked her up a size 2T. 
Mila tends to be really tall for her age. She's in like the 95 percentile for height. But as far as weight, she's, I believe, the 50... Yeah, 50th percentile for weight, so she's fairly thin and she fits into for the summer months. Usually 2T is her size. Come the winter and fall, you guys know that's where I have a problem because she's tall but then she's slender. You guys will also see again come later in the year when I do, when I have to go shopping for her for those colder months. I'll show you of course some options if you have a tall slender child that work out great. But for the summer, we can do 2T because it's short, so we don't have to worry about length. These do have like the stretchy spandex material, and like I said, for $5, you honestly can't go wrong. I bought it in this color, and then as well as like a light wash type of denim. On to like swim style, a lot of her swimsuits, um, we actually picked up ahead of time, like around Easter. My mom bought a couple of her, so she's worn a lot of them already because we did go on a family vacation a couple of months ago, so we used them. And then just for her birthday, we went to Hershey Park, so she wore her swimsuits there so they're well loved I just wanted to show you one of my favorites as far as ones that are rash guards and this is also from Target the cat and jack line these are the little bottoms as you can see it's this really pretty like pastel pink and then it has I love this little detail on the side it just makes it a little bit cuter and it looks really cute on her little bum so that's the bottom and then for the top this was the rash guard it is a white type of color and then if you guys can see it there it has like a mermaid tail and waves like coming out of the ocean and it matches perfectly with that i bought her a cover-up that matches from target as well it's all the same colors but same thing i could not find it right now <laughs> um but yeah this was at target i do see that they still have them available and for swimsuits like this, I do size up because they tend to shrink a little bit in the wash. So I bought her a 3T in this. It looks super cute on her and it's super comfortable. And then best of all, these are SPF 50. So anything protecting her from the sun, because when they get older, they do not want you putting any type of sunblock on them as much as you try. So this is just an easier way to get them a little extra protection and you don't have to be applying the sunblock 20 million times while you're at the beach. While we're still diving into swim, if you guys saw Mila's birthday vlog on here, you would know that she's totally obsessed with Moana. So my mom actually picked up this little um, cover up for her. It's just like this really pretty blue shade and it has this nice pattern on it right there. And of course we have little Moana in the little corner there. This is so incredibly soft. Also has SPF. 50 for it so that's also great another area of protection even in her um, cover-up has these nice little straps on the sides and it's more of like a flowy so cute simple beach cover-up and then to go with that we have little flip-flops when she's by the pool and stuff of course the easiest thing is to wear like a pair of slides or flip-flops this way if they get wet or anything they don't get ruined and these are like little Moana and her characters on the bottom and then here you can see it has like a little seashell detailing so that paired with that matches perfectly and I know she'll be totally obsessed and want to wear it probably every day since it has Moana on it. Since I'm still talking about shoes, we'll go right in. I bought her another pair of water shoes, but of course she sized out of last year's. And this was the only color I was able to find. I honestly wasn't a fan of like the coral, just because as you can see, a lot of the stuff that I buy her is usually like pastels for the swimsuits and stuff. But it was all they had. I had a Babies R Us gift card, so I wanted to use it up. And these were $10, and since the store was closing, it had like 30% off, so really, really cheap. And honestly, they fit her really comfortably, so I can't complain. They're really great in the water. They stay on her feet. And these I got her in a size 7. She's usually a size, like, I want to say 5.5 right now, but I know her feet are going to get a little bit bigger. And for some reason, water shoes, I do notice they run really small. And then for her sandals that she's, of course, going to be wearing every day, like her everyday pair of sandals, I'm sure you guys find as no surprise, the Mila and Mason sandals. So Mila, of course, has the three colors she has the pink ones the gold and the silver so no matter what she's wearing she is going to be matching with any of her outfits super simple you guys know the velcro detailing matches with everything easy to put on so this is what she's been wearing every single day since the weather has gotten warmer and she will continue to wear for the rest of the summer next pair of shoes mike actually spotted in the store now i had no idea that there was a janie and jack outlet when we went to hershey park there happens to be one there in pennsylvania so we decided to do a little pit stop in there and the deals are just incredible on top of it already being outlets and discounted they have additional coupons and sales going on so these particular shoes mike found and i got 
out. They were so, so adorable. I'll just bring a little closer so you guys can see. It has like this fringe detailing. It's like an adorable boat type of shoe. And it is in the white color. This way it can match with anything. And these were, I believe, let's see if I still have the price on them. Okay, these were normally $60. They were on sale for $25.99, and then I got an additional 20% off that they were having that day in the whole store. And then for this, I got her a size 6. Jamie and Jack tends to run a little large on the shoes, I've noticed. So these will, of course, fit her for the summertime. And then just to show you another thing that I picked up from them while I was there were these little bows. I thought they were so adorable. So they're like this little schoolgirl style. Bows can be super expensive, guys. Like I'm looking at Etsy and things like that because I want to get her a couple of more. I've been obsessed with putting her hair like in the little pigtail buns. But they've been, I want to say, a good like $15 for a pair of bows on Etsy. Very similar to this. These were, these came out to being on clearance for $3.50 each. And then I had another 20% off. So that was a super great deal. She has already worn them and they just looked so cute on her. So that's perfect to go with like a plain white dress or if she's wearing like shorts and a little comfy t-shirt, that'll work out great. Then the next outfit that I picked up for her, I was looking for something like very comfortable. I went into Carter's and I found this cute little two piece set. It's black and white so it's a pretty neutral and it says sweetheart on it in like script font i thought it was really cute like razorback style and then it does have the matching little shorts same thing the little sweetheart it says so these two pair together it's a super simple like everyday outfit that will look cute on her and she can play at the park or anything like that then on to just some basic t-shirts i picked up for her to wear so I have just this little um, mommy and baby giraffe wearing little shades. This one I got from Cat and Jack at Target. All of these t-shirts, the most I paid was $5. A couple of them were from like the clearance section. So this one from Carter's, it has like the little 3B balloons and a little gold glitter bicycle. So I thought that was cute. So those little plain shorts that I showed you guys from Target, I figured I'd pair like these tops with them. We just need something quick to put on her. Then this little one, Be Kind, this one was in the clearance section at Carter's for like $3, yeah. And then this little shirt here, this one's like a little bit fancier of a flowy tee. It has this little like bow detailing on it, it's white, and then it does have this like eyelet detail on the bottom. So this one, maybe not for the park, but if we just need to like go out for the day for like a quick little family dinner or something, this little pair of shorts I figured would be perfect. See. For this next outfit, sorry, I'm just gonna pop it inside out because Mila is obsessed with going in her drawers and already trying on all her clothes. <laughs> so she did do that with this outfit already. This were one of my favorite online shops called Bailey Blossoms. They recently had a big sale that I shared with you guys on my Instagram. So this actually is a little romper and it's in this really pretty gray shade and then it has this white detailing on the sleeves. On the sleeves, it's like a little lace detailing. I'm not sure if you guys can see it there. And then the buttons are like this brown type of shade. Just to show you a little bit closer. So it is like a one piece romper, it's pants. This one I did go up in sizing. This way she can wear it for, I wanna say closer to like the end of summer into the fall time since it does have the pants at the bottom. But this is just adorable and I can't wait for her to wear it. She already tried it on and it looks so cute. If I can find some cute gray little pigtail bows on Etsy, I figured I would pair it with this cute little outfit. The next hat that I have, she got for her birthday, and it's this adorable little halter top in this coral shade. All this like lace eyelet detailing, then the back is like ruching on the back, so it stretches and it could be nice and comfortable for her. When you're tan, this color looks great, so I know it'll look really cute on her. And then a pair of white pants, so she can pair that with this outfit or any of her other shirts. I had a pair of white jeans for her last year and she literally wore the heck out of them. So I knew these would come in handy for this year as well. And both of these were the um, Oshkosh brand at Target. The final thing for clothing is going to be Old Navy. So I picked up this little romper for her. It's green and the main reason I picked it up for her is because they had a very similar one for me there. So I bought one for myself and then I figured we could be twinning with our little rompers. Hers is shorts and of course like this um, spaghetti strap style with a little like, I wanna say like a bell sleeve to it. Mine is more like a three quarter sleeve. And this top I literally couldn't pass up. It's this light pink shade. It's very stretchy and comfortable and it has these two little French bulldogs and says, best friend cheese. 
so cute. They're drinking their little frappuccinos, so I thought this was a really adorable shirt. And this one came out to $1.50. So come on guys, you really can't beat the price. And then the last item that I got from there was this little romper. I just love the denim style. It has this little fluttered sleeve. I thought it looked really pretty on her. You can wear it just like this, which I see a lot of people do, but because Mila's a little bit older now, I personally don't feel comfortable just putting her in this one piece little outfit like I did when she was a baby. So what I'll do is probably pair it with like a little pair of jean shorts or even that those white jeans. This way it'll pick up the white detailing from the sleeves and I think that'll look really nice. And the last thing to show you guys, I already showed you the bows from Janie and Jack, but another set of bows that I picked up was from Hobby Lobby. You guys know if you follow me on Instagram, Mila likes to wear like glitter bows a lot of the time, and those I do get at Hobby Lobby. I found these there the other day, and I thought they were so adorable. They were $2.99 a piece, but then I, of course, had their 40% coupon that they always have going on, and they're this really pretty blush shade. So same thing, if I just want to put her hair up to side pony and put one big bow, it looks really cute, or two big ones will look adorable when I do the pigtails. So that's just what they look like there. And you guys know I'm obsessed with blush, so I had to get these blush bows for her. And that is everything for my summer toddler haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to give it a big thumbs up if you did, and I'll talk to you all in my next one. Bye!